Gibraltar, Spanish pronunciation, Xi Beta Al Ta, is a British overseas territory located at the southern tip of the Iberian Peninsula. It has an area of 6.7 square kilometers, 2.6 square miles, and is bordered to the north by Spain. The landscape is dominated by the Rock of Gibraltar at the foot of which is a densely populated city area, home to over 30,000 people, primarily Gibraltarians. It shares a maritime border with Morocco. In 1704, Anglo-Dutch forces captured Gibraltar from Spain during the War of the Spanish Succession on behalf of the Habsburg claim to the Spanish throne. The territory was ceded to Great Britain in perpetuity under the Treaty of Utrecht in 1713. During World War II it was an important base for the Royal Navy as it controlled the entrance and exit to the Mediterranean Sea, which is only 8 miles 13 km wide at this naval choke point. It remains strategically important, with half the world's seaborne trade passing through the strait. Today Gibraltar's economy is based largely on tourism, online gambling, financial services and cargo ship refueling. The sovereignty of Gibraltar is a point of contention in Anglo-Spanish relations because Spain asserts a claim to the territory. Gibraltarians rejected proposals for Spanish sovereignty in a 1967 referendum and in a 2002 referendum the idea of shared sovereignty was also rejected. History Prehistory and ancient history Evidence of Neanderthal habitation in Gibraltar from around 50,000 years ago has been discovered at Gaham's Cave. The caves of Gibraltar continued to be used by Homo sapiens after the final extinction of the Neanderthals. Stone tools, ancient hearths and animal bones dating from around 40,000 years ago to about 5,000 years ago have been found in deposits left in Gaham's cave. Numerous potsherds dating from the Neolithic period have been found in Gibraltar's caves, mostly of types typical of the Almerian culture found elsewhere in Andalusia, especially around the town of Almeria, from which it takes its name. There is little evidence of habitation in the Bronze Age, when people had largely abandoned the tradition of living in caves. During ancient times, Gibraltar was regarded by the peoples of the Mediterranean as a place of religious and symbolic importance. The Phoenicians were present for several centuries since around 950 BC, apparently using Gaham's cave as a shrine to the genius Loci, as did the Carthaginians and Romans after them. Gibraltar was known as Mons Calpa, a name perhaps of Phoenician origin. Mons Kalpa was considered by the ancient Greeks and Romans as one of the pillars of Hercules, after the Greek legend of the creation of the Strait of Gibraltar by Heracles. There is no known archaeological evidence of permanent settlements from the ancient period. They settled at the head of the bay in what is today known as the Campo hinterland of Gibraltar. The town of Cartea, near the location of the modern Spanish town of San Roque, was founded by the Phoenicians around 950 BC on the site of an early settlement of the native Turdetani people. <laughs> Middle Ages After the collapse of the Western Roman Empire, Gibraltar came briefly under the control of the Vandals, who crossed into Africa at the invitation of Boniface, the count or commander of the territory. The area later formed part of the Visigothic Kingdom of Hispania for almost 300 years, from 414 until 711 AD. Following a raid in 710, a predominantly Berber army under the command of Tariq ibn Ziyad crossed from North Africa in April 711 and landed somewhere in the vicinity of Gibraltar though most likely not in the bay or at the rock itself. Tariq's expedition led to the Islamic conquest of most of the Iberian Peninsula. Mons Kalpa was renamed Jebel Tariq, the Mount of Tariq, subsequently corrupted into Gibraltar. In 1160, the Almohad Sultan Abd al Mumin ordered that a permanent settlement, including a castle, be built. It received the name of Medinat al Fath. City of the, Victory. the Tower of Homage of the Moorish Castle remains standing today. From 1274 onwards, the town was fought over and captured by the Nasrids of Granada in 1237 and 1374, the Marinids of Morocco in 1274 and 1333, and the Kings of Castile in 1309. Topic: <laughs> Modern Era. 
In 1462, Gibraltar was captured by Juan Alonso de Guzman, 1st Duke of Medina Sidonia. After the conquest, Henry IV of Castile assumed the additional title of King of Gibraltar, establishing it as part of the Comarca of the Campo Lano de Gibraltar. Six years later, Gibraltar was restored to the Duke of Medina Sidonia, who sold it in 1474 to a group of 4,350 conversos Christian converts from Judaism from Cordova and Seville and in exchange for maintaining the garrison of the town for two years, after which time they were expelled, returning to their hometowns or moving on to other parts of Spain. In 1501, Gibraltar passed back to the Spanish crown, and Isabella I of Castile issued a royal warrant granting Gibraltar the coat of arms that it still uses today. In 1704, during the War of the Spanish Succession, a combined Anglo-Dutch fleet, representing the Grand Alliance, captured the town of Gibraltar on behalf of the Archduke Charles of Austria in his campaign to become King of Spain. The occupation of the town by Alliance forces caused the exodus of the population. As the Alliance's campaign faltered, the 1713 Treaty of Utrecht was negotiated and ceded control of Gibraltar to Britain to secure Britain's withdrawal from the war. Unsuccessful attempts by Spanish monarchs to regain Gibraltar were made with the Siege of 1727 and again with the Great Siege of Gibraltar, 1779-1783, during the American War of Independence. Gibraltar became a key base for the Royal Navy and played an important role prior to the Battle of Trafalgar the 21st of October 1805 and during the Crimean War of 1854-56, because of its strategic location. In the 18th century, the peacetime military garrison fluctuated in numbers from a minimum of 1,100 to a maximum of 5,000. The first half of the 19th century saw a significant increase of population to more than 17,000 in 1860, as people from Britain and all around the Mediterranean Italian, Portuguese, Maltese, Jewish and French took up residence in the town. Its strategic value increased with the opening of the Suez Canal, as it lay on the sea route between the UK and the British Empire east of Suez. In the later 19th century, there were major investments in improving the fortifications and the port. Topic: Contemporary history. During the Second World War, Gibraltar's civilian population was evacuated, mainly to London, but also to parts of Morocco and Madeira, and to Gibraltar Camp in Jamaica. The rock was strengthened as a fortress. The naval base and the ships based there played a key role in the provisioning and supply of the island of Malta during its long siege as well as frequent short runs known as club runs towards Malta to fly off aircraft reinforcements initially hurricanes but later, notably from the USN aircraft carrier WASP, Spitfires, the critical Operation Pedestal Convoy was run from Gibraltar in August 1942. This resupplied the island at a critical time in the face of concentrated air attacks from German and Italian forces. Spanish dictator Francisco Franco's reluctance to allow the German army onto Spanish soil frustrated a German plan to capture the rock, codenamed Operation Felix. In the 1950s, Franco renewed Spain's claim to sovereignty over Gibraltar and restricted movement between Gibraltar and Spain. Gibraltarians voted overwhelmingly to remain under British sovereignty in the Gibraltar Sovereignty Referendum, 1967, which led to the passing of the Gibraltar Constitution Order in 1969. In response, Spain completely closed the border with Gibraltar and severed all communication links. The border with Spain was partially reopened in 1982 and fully reopened in 1985 before Spain's accession to the European community. In a referendum held in 2002, Gibraltarians rejected by an overwhelming majority a proposal of shared sovereignty on which Spain and Britain were said to have reached broad agreement. The British government has committed itself to respecting the Gibraltarians' wishes. A new constitution order was approved in referendum in 2006. A process of tripartite negotiations started in 2006 between Spain, Gibraltar and the UK, ending some restrictions and dealing with disputes in some specific areas such as air movements, customs procedures, telecommunications, pensions and cultural exchange. In the British referendum on membership of the European Union 96% of Gibraltarians voted to remain on an 82% turnout. Spain renewed calls for joint Spanish-British control of the peninsula, these were strongly rebuffed by Gibraltar's chief minister. 
On October 18, 2018, however, Spain seemed to have reached an agreement with the United Kingdom in relation to its objections to Gibraltar leaving the EU with Britain, with Spanish Prime Minister Pedro Sánchez stating, Gibraltar will no longer be a problem in arriving at a Brexit deal. Governance <inaudible> 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 Under its current constitution, Gibraltar has almost complete internal self-governance through a parliament elected for a term of up to four years. The unicameral parliament presently consists of 17 elected members, and the speaker who is not elected, but appointed by a resolution of the parliament. The government consists of 10 elected members. The head of state is the British monarch, currently Queen Elizabeth II, who is represented by the governor of Gibraltar. The governor enacts day-to-day -day matters on the advice of the Gibraltar Parliament, but is responsible to the British government in respect of defence, foreign policy, internal security and general good governance. Judicial and other appointments are made on behalf of the monarch in consultation with the head of the elected government. The 2011 election was contested by the Gibraltar Social Democrats (GSD), Gibraltar Socialist Labour Party (GSLP), Gibraltar Liberal Party (GLP) alliance, and the Progressive Democratic Party (PDP). The PDP was a new party formed in 2006 and fielded candidates in the 2007 election, but none were elected. The head of government is the chief minister as of December 2011, Fabian Picardo. All local political parties oppose any transfer of sovereignty to Spain, instead supporting self-determination. The main UK opposition parties also support this policy, and it is British government policy not to engage in talks about the sovereignty of Gibraltar without the consent of the people of Gibraltar. Gibraltar is part of the European Union, having joined through the European Communities Act 1972, UK, which gave effect to the Treaty of Accession 1972, as a dependent territory of the United Kingdom under what was then Article 227 of the treaty establishing the European Community covering special member state territories, with exemption from some areas such as the European Union Customs Union, Common Agricultural Policy and the Schengen Area. It is the only British overseas territory which is part of the European Union. After a 10-year campaign for the right to vote in European elections, since 2004 the people of Gibraltar have participated in elections for the European Parliament as part of the South West England constituency. On 23 June 2016 Gibraltar voted along with the United Kingdom in the EU referendum, 96% of its population voted to remain, but the overall United Kingdom result gave a 51.9% majority to leaving the EU. Nevertheless, Spanish President Pedro Sánchez stated on 18 October 2018 that the Gibraltar Protocol had been resolved and that Spain will hold no objection when Gibraltar leaves the EU with Britain. Gibraltar was nominated to be included on the United Nations list of non-self-governing territories by the United Kingdom when the list was created in 1946 and has been listed ever since. The government of Gibraltar has actively worked to have Gibraltar removed from the list, and in 2008 the British government declared Gibraltar's continued presence on the list an anachronism. Gibraltar is not a member of the Commonwealth of Nations in its own right and is represented by the United Kingdom but was granted associate membership of the Commonwealth Foundation in 2004. Gibraltar has competed in the Commonwealth Games since 1958. Topic. Geography Gibraltar's territory covers 6.7 square kilometers, 2.6 square miles, and shares a 1.2 kilometers, 0.75 miles land border with Spain. The town of La Línea de la Concepción, a municipality of the province of Cádiz, lies on the Spanish side of the border. The Spanish hinterland forms the comarca of Campo de Gibraltar, literally, countryside of Gibraltar. The shoreline measures 12 kilometers, 7.5 miles in length. There are two coasts, sides of Gibraltar, the east side, which contains the settlements of Sandy Bay and Catalan Bay, and the west side, where the vast majority of the population lives. Gibraltar has no administrative divisions but is divided into 7 major residential areas. Having negligible natural resources and few natural freshwater resources, limited to natural wells in the north, until recently Gibraltar used large concrete and or natural rock water catchments to collect rainwater. 
Fresh water from the boreholes is supplemented by two desalination plants, a reverse osmosis plant, constructed in a tunnel within the rock, and a multi-stage flash distillation plant at North Mole. Gibraltar's terrain consists of the 426-meter-high rock of Gibraltar made of Jurassic limestone, and the narrow coastal lowland surrounding it. It contains many tunneled roads, most of which are still operated by the military and closed to the general public. Topic. Climate Gibraltar has a Mediterranean climate Köppen climate classification CSA, with mild, rainy winters and warm, dry summers. As is the case for nearby Algeciras and Tarifa, summers are significantly cooler and annual temperature more constant than other cities on the southern coast of the Iberian Peninsula because of its position on the Strait of Gibraltar. Rain occurs mainly in winter, with summer being generally dry. Its average annual temperature is about 22 degrees Celsius 72 degrees Fahrenheit as a daily high and 15 degrees Celsius 59 degrees Fahrenheit as the overnight low. In the coldest month, January, the high temperature averages 16.3 degrees Celsius .3 degrees Fahrenheit and the overnight low is 11 degrees Celsius 52 degrees Fahrenheit and the average sea temperature is 16 degrees Celsius 61 degrees Fahrenheit. In the warmest month, August, the daily high temperature is 25 degrees Celsius, 77 degrees Fahrenheit. The overnight low is 20 degrees Celsius, 68 degrees Fahrenheit, and the average sea temperature is 22 degrees Celsius, 72 degrees Fahrenheit. Topic: <inaudible> Flora and fauna. Over 500 different species of flowering plants grow on the rock. Gibraltar is the only place in Europe where the Gibraltar candytuft Abaris gibraltaritsa is found growing in the wild, the plant is otherwise native to North Africa. It is the symbol of the Upper Rock Nature Reserve. Olive and pine trees are among the most common of those growing around the rock. Most of the rock's upper area is covered by a nature reserve which is home to around 230 Barbary macaques, the famous apes of Gibraltar, which are actually monkeys. These are the only wild apes or monkeys found in Europe. This species, known scientifically as Macaca sylvanus, is listed as endangered by the IUCN Red List and is declining. Three quarters of the world population live in the Middle Atlas Mountains of Morocco. Recent genetic studies and historical documents point to their presence on the rock before its capture by the British, having possibly been introduced during the Islamic period. A superstition analogous to that of the ravens at the Tower of London states that if the apes ever leave, so will the British. In 1944, British Prime Minister Winston Churchill, was so concerned about the dwindling population of apes that he sent a message to the colonial secretary requesting that something be done about the situation. Other mammals found in Gibraltar include rabbits, foxes and bats. Dolphins and whales are frequently seen in the Bay of Gibraltar. Migrating birds are very common and Gibraltar is home to the only Barbary partridges found on the European continent. In 1991, Graham Watson, Gibraltar's MEP, highlighted conservationists' fears that urban development, tourism and invasive plant species were threatening Gibraltar's own plants as well as birds and bat species. Environment In May 2016 a report by the World Health Organization showed that Gibraltar had the worst air quality in any British territory. The report concentrated on PM10 and PM2.5 pollutants in the air. Topic economy The British military traditionally dominated Gibraltar's economy, with the naval dockyard providing the bulk of economic activity. This, however, has diminished over the last 20 years, and is estimated to account for only 7% of the local economy, compared to over 60% in 1984. Today, Gibraltar's economy is dominated by four main sectors, financial services, online gambling, shipping, and tourism, which includes duty-free retail sales to visitors. The territory also has a small manufacturing sector, with one company supplying ambulances produced from converted SUV vehicles to the United Nations and other agencies. In the early 2000s, many bookmakers and online gaming operators moved to Gibraltar to benefit from operating in a regulated jurisdiction with a favorable corporate tax regime. 
This corporate tax regime for non-resident controlled companies was phased out by January 2011 and replaced by a still favorable fixed corporate tax rate of 10%. Tourism is also a significant industry. Gibraltar is a popular port for cruise ships and attracts day visitors from resorts in Spain. The Rock is a popular tourist attraction, particularly among British tourists and residents in the southern coast of Spain. It is also a popular shopping destination, and all goods and services are VAT-free, but may be subject to Gibraltar taxes. Many of the large British high street chains have branches or franchises in Gibraltar including Morrison's, Marks and Spencer and Mothercare. Branches and franchises of international retailers such as Tommy Hilfiger and Sunglass Hut are also present in Gibraltar, as is the Spanish clothing company Mango. A number of British and international banks have operations based in Gibraltar. Jiski Bank claims to be the oldest bank in the country, based on Jiski's acquisition in 1987 of Banco Galliano, which began operations in Gibraltar in 1855. An ancestor of Barclays, the Anglo-Egyptian bank, entered in 1888, and Credit Foncier now Credit Agricole entered in 1920. In 1967, Gibraltar enacted the company's Taxation and Concessions Ordinance now an act, which provided for special tax treatment for international business. This was one of the factors leading to the growth of professional services such as private banking and captive insurance management. Gibraltar has several attractive attributes as a financial centre, including a common law legal system and access to the EU single market in financial services. The Financial Services Commission FSC, which was established by an ordinance in 1989 now an act that took effect in 1991, regulates the finance sector. In 1997, the Department of Trade and Industry established its Gibraltar Finance Center GFC division to facilitate the development the financial sector development. As of 2012, Gibraltar has 0.103 Big Four accounting firm offices per 1,000 population, the second highest in the world after the British Virgin Islands, and 0.6 banks per 1,000 people, the fifth most banks per capita in the world. As of 2017, there is very significant uncertainty on continuing access to the EU single market after the forthcoming Brexit. The currency of Gibraltar is the Gibraltar pound, issued by the government of Gibraltar under the terms of the 1934 Currency Notes Act. These banknotes are legal tender in Gibraltar alongside Bank of England banknotes. In a currency board arrangement, these notes are issued against reserves of sterling. Clearing and settlement of funds is conducted in sterling. Coins in circulation follow British denominations but have separate designs. And officially, most retail outlets in Gibraltar accept the euro, though some payphones and the Royal Gibraltar Post Office, along with all other government offices, do not. <laughs> Demographics Gibraltar is one of the most densely populated territories in the world, with a usually resident population in 2012 of 32,194 equivalent to approximately 4,959 inhabitants per square kilometre 12,840 per square miles. The growing demand for space is being increasingly met by land reclamation. Reclaimed land currently comprises approximately one-tenth of the territory's total area. Ethnic groups The demographics of Gibraltar reflect the many European and other economic migrants who came to the Rock over 300 years, after almost all of the Spanish population left in 1704. Origin of surnames in the electoral roll by percentage is, British 27%, Spanish 26%, mostly Andalusian but also some 2% Menorcan, Genoese and other Italian 15%, Portuguese 15%, and Maltese 8%. There are also small less than 1% populations of other groups such as Moroccans, French, Austrians, Chinese, Japanese, Polish and Danish. Asterisk includes all nationalities different from Gibraltarian, UK and other British and Moroccan. Topic: <laughs> Language. The official language of Gibraltar is English and is used by the government and in schools. Most locals are bilingual, also speaking Spanish. However, because of the varied mix of ethnic groups which reside there, other languages are also spoken on the rock. 
Berber and Arabic are spoken by the Moroccan community, as are Hindi and Sindhi by the Indian community. Maltese is spoken by some families of Maltese descent. Gibraltarians often converse in Lanito, pronounced Anito, a vernacular unique to Gibraltar. It is based on Andalusian Spanish with a strong mixture of British English and elements from languages such as Maltese, Portuguese, Genoese Italian, and Hakisha, a Judeo Spanish dialect. Lanito also often involves code switching to English and Spanish. Gibraltarians often call themselves Lanitos. Religion According to the 2012 census, approximately 72.1% of Gibraltarians are Roman Catholics. The 16th century St. Mary the Crowned is the cathedral church of the Roman Catholic Diocese of Gibraltar, and also the oldest Catholic church in the territory. Other Christian denominations include the Church of England 7.7%, whose Cathedral of the Holy Trinity is the Cathedral of the Anglican Bishop of Gibraltar in Europe, the Gibraltar Methodist Church, Church of Scotland, various Pentecostal and independent churches mostly influenced by the House Church and Charismatic movements, as well as a Plymouth Brethren congregation. Several of these congregations are represented by the Gibraltar Evangelical Alliance, there is also a ward of the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints, and two congregations of Jehovah's Witnesses, 7.1% advise that they have no religion. The Gibraltar Secular Humanist Society also holds regular meetings. The third religion in size is Islam 3.6% of the population. There is also an established Hindu population 2%, members of the Baha'i faith and a long-established Jewish community, which, at 763 persons, accounts for 2.4% of the population. As a share of the total population, this is the second largest Jewish population in the world, trailing only Israel. There are four functioning Orthodox synagogues in Gibraltar and several kosher establishments. Education Education in Gibraltar generally follows the English model, operating within a three-tier system. Schools in Gibraltar use the key stage modular approach to teach the national curriculum. Gibraltar has 15 state schools, two private schools and a college of further education, Gibraltar College. Government secondary schools are Bayside Comprehensive School for Boys and Westside School for Girls, and Prior Park School Gibraltar is an independent coeducational secondary school. On 31 March 2015, the Government of Gibraltar announced the adoption of the University of Gibraltar Act, and the University of Gibraltar opened in September 2015. Previously, there were no facilities in Gibraltar for full-time higher education, and consequently, all Gibraltarian students studied elsewhere at degree level or its equivalent and also for certain non-degree courses. The Government of Gibraltar operates a scholarship, grant system to provide funding for students studying in the United Kingdom. All Gibraltarian students used to follow the UK student loans procedure, applying for a loan from the student loans company which was then reimbursed in full by the Government of Gibraltar. In August 2010, this system was replaced by the direct payment by the government of grants and tuition fees. The overwhelming majority of Gibraltarians continue their studies at university level. Health care See Health in Gibraltar Culture The culture of Gibraltar reflects Gibraltarians' diverse origins. While there are Spanish mostly from nearby Andalusia and British influences, the ethnic origins of most Gibraltarians are not confined to these ethnicities. Other ethnicities include Genoese, Maltese, Portuguese, and German. A few other Gibraltar residents are Jewish of Sephardic origin, Moroccan, or Indians. British influence remains strong, with English being the language of government, commerce, education and the media. Gibraltar's first sovereignty referendum is celebrated annually on Gibraltar National Day, the 10th of September. It is a public holiday during which most Gibraltarians dress in their national colors of red and white. Until 2016, the tradition had been to also release 30,000 similarly colored balloons, which represented the people of Gibraltar. However, this tradition has now been ended because of the threat that it poses to wildlife, particularly marine. 
The 300th anniversary of Gibraltar's capture was celebrated in 2004 on Tercentenary Day, the 4th of August, when in recognition of and with thanks for its long association with Gibraltar, the Royal Navy was given the freedom of the city of Gibraltar and a human chain of Gibraltarians dressed in red, white and blue, linked hands to encircle the rock. On 4 June 2012, the Gibraltar Diamond Jubilee Flotilla, inspired by the Thames Diamond Jubilee pageant, celebrated 60 years of the Queen's reign. The Gibraltar Broadcasting Corporation operates a television and radio station on UHF, VHF, and medium wave. The radio service is also internet streamed. Special events and the daily news bulletin are streamed in video. The other local radio service is operated by the British Forces Broadcasting Service which also provides a limited cable television network to HM Forces. The largest and most frequently published newspaper is the Gibraltar Chronicle, Gibraltar's oldest established daily newspaper and the world's second oldest English language newspaper to have been in print continuously with daily editions six days a week. Panorama is published on weekdays, and seven days, The New People, and Gibsport are weekly. Native Gibraltarians have produced some literature of note. The first in fiction was probably Hector Licuti's 1929 novel Barbarita, written in Spanish, chronicling the largely autobiographical adventures of a young Gibraltarian man. Throughout the 1940s and 1950s, several anthologies of poetry were published by Leopoldo Sanguinetti, Albert Joseph Patron and Alberto Pizzarello. The 1960s were largely dominated by the theatrical works of Elio Cruz and his two highly acclaimed Spanish language plays La Lola Se Va Pa Londor and Connie Con Cama Camera and El Comedor. In the 1990s, the Gibraltarian man of letters Mario Arroyo published Profiles, 1994, a series of bilingual meditations on love, loneliness, and death. Trino Cruz is a bilingual poet originally writing English but now mainly in Spanish, who also translates Maghreb poetry. Of late there have been works by the essayist Mary Kiap, such as her volume of essays Cabbages and Kings 2006, and by M. G. Sanchez, author of the books Rock Black, Ten Gibraltarian Stories 2008, and Diary of a Victorian Colonial 2009. Mary Kiap and Sam Benedy have also published a series of detective books centered on the character of the 19th-century Gibraltarian sleuth Bresciano. Musicians from Gibraltar include Charles Ramirez, the first guitarist invited to play with the Royal College of Music Orchestra, successful rock bands like Breed 77, Melon Diesel and Taxi, while Gibraltarian bassist Glenn Diani played for Irish, British new metal group One Minute Silence. Albert Hammond had top ten hits in the UK and US and has written many songs for international artists such as Whitney Houston, Tina Turner and Julio Iglesias. Gibraltarian cuisine is the result of a long relationship between the Andalusian Spaniards and the British, as well as the many foreigners who made Gibraltar their home over the past three centuries. The culinary influences include those from Malta, Genoa, Portugal, Andalusia and Britain. This marriage of tastes has given Gibraltar an eclectic mix of Mediterranean and British cuisine. Profiteroles, a French choux pastry ball with a sweet filling of whipped cream, is considered to be Gibraltar's national dish. These are often served after a meal including calentita, a baked bread-like dish made with chickpea flour, water, olive oil, salt and pepper. Sport. In 2007, there were 18 Gibraltar sports associations with official recognition from their respective international governing bodies. Others have submitted applications for recognition which are being considered. The government supports the many sporting associations financially. Gibraltar also competes in the bi-annual Island Games, which it hosted in 1995. Football is a popular sport in Gibraltar. The Gibraltar Football Association applied for full membership of UEFA, but their bid was turned down in 2007 in a contentious decision. Gibraltar was confirmed as UEFA's 54th member on 24 May 2013 as a result of Court of Arbitration for Sport CAS arbitration and played in Euro 2016 qualifications. Their first match was a 0-0 draw against Slovakia. Gibraltar's national team won its first ever match in UEFA competition on 13 October 2018, beating Armenia in the 2018-19 UEFA Nations League D. Subsequently, Gibraltar applied for FIFA membership but this bid was also turned down. 
On 2 May 2016 the CAS upheld the appeal filed by the Gibraltar Football Association regarding its request to become a full-time member of FIFA. CAS ordered FIFA to stop blocking Gibraltar's application for membership and allow it. Without delay, cricket enjoys popularity in Gibraltar. The Gibraltar national cricket team won the European Cricket Championship Division 2 in 2000 and 2002. Rugby union is fairly popular and one of the fastest growing team sports. Gibraltar Rugby Football Union applied for membership of Europe's governing body for rugby. Gibraltar is believed to be the birthplace of the rugby variant Tag Rugby. The Gibraltar Rifle Association (GRA) was Gibraltar's most successful team at the 2009 Island Games, earning 4 gold medals. Darts is also a popular sport, with the Gibraltar Darts Association, a full member of World Darts Federation since 1977, running leagues and other regular tournaments. In 2010, Gibraltar hosted and won the Mediterranean Cup, competing against France, Italy, Turkey, Malta and Cyprus. Communications Gibraltar has a digital telephone exchange supported by a fiber optic and copper infrastructure. The telephone operator Gibtelecom also operates a GSM network. Internet connectivity is available across the fixed network. Gibraltar's top-level domain code is GI. International Direct Dialing IDD is provided, and Gibraltar was allocated the access code plus 350 by the International Telecommunication Union. This has been universally valid since 10 February 2007, when the telecom dispute was resolved. Transport Within Gibraltar, the main form of transport is the car. Motorcycles are also very popular and there is a good modern bus service. Unlike in the UK and other British territories, traffic drives on the right and speed limits are in kilometer per hour, as the territory shares a land border with Spain. The E15 highway connecting Spain, France, and the United Kingdom is accessible from the Spanish side using the CA34 Autovia. There is a Gibraltar cable car that runs from ground level to the top of the rock, with an intermediate station at Apes Den. Restrictions on transport introduced by Spanish dictator Francisco Franco closed the land frontier in 1969 and also prohibited any air or ferry connections. In 1982, the land border was reopened. As the result of an agreement signed in Córdoba on 18 September 2006 between Gibraltar, the United Kingdom and Spain, the Spanish government agreed to relax border controls at the frontier that have plagued locals for decades. In return, Britain paid increased pensions to Spanish workers who lost their jobs when Franco closed the border. Telecommunication restrictions were lifted in February 2007 and air links with Spain were restored in December 2006. The border control is the only road border control between two EU members that is expected to remain indefinitely. Bulgaria, Croatia and Romania have border controls which are expected to be removed around 2020. However, Britain plans to leave the EU. Motorists and pedestrians crossing the border with Spain are occasionally subjected to very long delays. Spain has occasionally closed the border during disputes or incidents involving the Gibraltar authorities, such as the Aurora cruise ship incident and when fishermen from the Spanish fishing vessel Piranha were arrested for illegal fishing in Gibraltar waters. Air As of 2017, Gibraltar maintains regular flight connections with London, Manchester and Bristol in the UK, and with Casablanca and Tangier in Morocco. GB Airways operated a service between Gibraltar and London and other cities for many years. The airline initially flew under the name, Gibraltar Airways. In 1989, and in anticipation of service to cities outside the UK, Gibraltar Airways changed its name to GB Airways with the belief that a new name would incur fewer political problems. As a franchise, the airline operated flights in full British Airways livery. In 2007, GB Airways was purchased by EasyJet, which began operating flights under their name in April 2008 when British Airways reintroduced flights to Gibraltar under their name. EasyJet have since added Bristol and Manchester and also operated flights to Liverpool between 2011 and 2012. 
Until entering administration in October 2017, Monarch Airlines operated the largest number of flights between the United Kingdom and Gibraltar, with scheduled services between Gibraltar and Luton, London Gatwick, Birmingham and Manchester. The Spanish national airline, Iberia, operated a daily service to Madrid which ceased for lack of demand. In May 2009, Andalus Líneas Aéreas opened a Spanish service, which also ceased operations in March 2010. An annual return charter flight to Malta is operated by Maltese national airline, Air Malta. Gibraltar International Airport is unusual not only because of its proximity to the city centre resulting in the airport terminal being within walking distance of much of Gibraltar but also because the runway intersects Winston Churchill Avenue, the main north-south street, requiring movable barricades to close when aircraft land or depart. New roads and a tunnel, which will end the need to stop road traffic when aircraft use the runway, were planned to coincide with the building of a new airport terminal building with an originally estimated completion date of 2009, although it has not been completed because of delays. The most popular alternative airport for Gibraltar is Malaga Airport in Spain, some 120 kilometers (75 miles) to the east, which offers a wide range of destinations, second to Jerez Airport, which is closer to Gibraltar. In addition, the Algeciras heliport across the bay offers scheduled services to Ceuta. C Gibraltar Cruise Terminal receives a large number of visits from cruise ships. The Strait of Gibraltar is one of the busiest shipping lanes in the world. Passenger and cargo ships anchor in the Gibraltar Harbour. Also, a ferry links Gibraltar with Tangier in Morocco. The ferry between Gibraltar and Algeciras, which had been halted in 1969 when Franco severed communications with Gibraltar, was finally reopened on 16 December 2009, served by the Spanish company Transcoma. Ferries by FRS running twice a week from Gibraltar to Tangier Med Port provide access to the Moroccan railway system. Rail While railway track extends to the outskirts of La Linea from an aborted rail expansion project in the 1970s, the closest railway station in Spain is San Roque Station, accessible via buses from La Linea. Water supply and sanitation Water supply and sanitation in Gibraltar have been major concerns for its inhabitants throughout its history. There are no rivers, streams, or large bodies of water on the peninsula. Gibraltar's water supply was formerly provided by a combination of an aqueduct, wells, and the use of cisterns, barrels and earthenware pots to capture rainwater. This became increasingly inadequate as Gibraltar's population grew in the 18th and 19th centuries and lethal diseases such as cholera and yellow fever began to spread. In the late 19th century, a sanitary commission instigated major improvements which saw the introduction of large-scale desalination and the use of giant water catchments covering over 2.5 million square feet nearly 250,000 square meters. Today Gibraltar's supply of drinking water comes entirely from desalination, with a separate supply of saltwater for sanitary purposes. Both supplies are delivered from huge underground reservoirs excavated under the rock of Gibraltar. Police The Royal Gibraltar Police RGP, Gibraltar Defence Police GDP, and Her Majesty's Customs Gibraltar are Gibraltar's principal civilian law enforcement agencies. Outside the United Kingdom, the RGP is the oldest police force of the former British Empire, formed shortly after the creation of London's Metropolitan Police in 1829 when Gibraltar was declared a Crown Colony on 25 June 1830. In general, the Gibraltar force follows British police models in its dress and its mostly male constables and sergeants on foot patrol wear the traditional custodian helmet, the headgear of the British. Bobby on the beat. The helmet is traditionally made of cork covered outside by felt or serge-like material that matches the tunic. The vehicles also appear virtually identical to typical UK police vehicles, but are left-hand drive. The force, whose name received the prefix, Royal, in 1992, currently numbers over 220 officers divided into a number of units. 
These include the CID, Drug Squad, Special Branch, Firearms, Scene of Crime Examiners, Traffic, Marine and Operations Units, Sections or Departments. On 24 September 2015, the freedom of the city of Gibraltar was conferred upon the RGP by the mayor, Adolfo Canapa. Armed forces Gibraltar's defence is the responsibility of the United Kingdom Tri Services British Forces Gibraltar. In January 2007, the Ministry of Defence announced that the private company Serco would provide services to the base. The announcement resulted in the affected trade union striking. The Royal Gibraltar Regiment provides the Army Garrison with a detachment of the British Army, based at Devil's Tower Camp. The regiment was originally a part-time reserve force until the British Army placed it on a permanent footing in 1990. The regiment includes full-time and part-time soldiers recruited from Gibraltar as well as British Army regulars posted from other regiments. The Royal Navy maintains a squadron at the Rock. The squadron is responsible for the security and integrity of British Gibraltar Territorial Waters BGTW. The shore establishment at Gibraltar is called HMS Rook after Sir George Rook, who captured the rock for Archduke Charles pretender to the Spanish throne in 1704. The naval air base was named HMS Cormorant. Gibraltar's strategic position provides an important facility for the Royal Navy and Britain's allies. British and US nuclear submarines frequently visit the Z-berths at Gibraltar. A Z berth provides the facility for nuclear submarines to visit for operational or recreational purposes and for non-nuclear repairs. During the Falklands War, an Argentine plan to attack British shipping in the harbor using frogmen, Operation Algeciras, was foiled. The naval base also played a part in supporting the task force sent by Britain to recover the Falklands. The Royal Air Force Station at Gibraltar forms part of Headquarters British Forces Gibraltar. Although aircraft are no longer permanently stationed at RAF Gibraltar, a variety of RAF aircraft make regular visits and the airfield also houses a section from the Met Office. Gibraltar has an important role in UKS IGINT and provides a vital strategic part of the United Kingdom communications gathering and monitoring network in the Mediterranean and North Africa. Twin towns and sister cities See also List of Gibraltarians Chief Justice of Gibraltar Attorney General of Gibraltar 1943 Gibraltar B-24 crash Effect of Brexit on Gibraltar Footnotes Notes References Bibliography Topic External links Government of Gibraltar Royal Gibraltar Police Gibraltar Fire and Rescue Service